Whoop getting drunk, he's still up at five in the morning. Whoop did he do? Did you send a rant against someone with whoop did he do? Yeah. Because like I said, I've been working a lot and I'm getting sick of people. Like, oh, this guy's not doing a good job. It's time to go. I'm doing the best I can for everything. Aaron and his friends. Three days a week, I gotta do my show five days a week. And now I'm DJing. They had it all. Now they're turning on him One by one they fall Crippled co-host Crying on in and in The demise of a friendship Just too much to bear Laughter and banter Now a place with pain It's and die, huh? Yeah Now, I know everybody's probably wondering Nothing If we got anything to say the about same. the events of this morning oh, the, the hilarity that ensued <laughs> The events, hey, tell, us ab- tell us about it, Till well, I mean, like, I, I kind of w- was waiting for more things to play out, but we can, uh, you know, we can talk about what's happened so far. So this morning on Steel Toe, Steel Toe Morning Show, Mersh was still awake. And if he's still awake in the morning, that means he is shit-faced. Yep. And he's Hey, saying, hey, that's Uber Mersh. You could just say Uber Mersh. Uber Mersh? Yes. <laughs> Anyways, he, he got in the Steel Toast chat and he started sending super chats. And in one of them, he told Johnny that he sucked. And, uh, you know, just basically gave him shit in, like, this big of a space. Hey, what what's that guy's full name on the internet? Johnny what? Johnny Crutches? I thought it was Johnny Rockets. No? No, that's that's a porn thing. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Johnny I think that crushes. I think that's the channel that had all the like the interviews with the porn stars we we watched like years ago. I don't know. It still works more like Johnny Cryfits. Cryfit? Is I don't think he's Irish. He had a, he had a cry fit today. Eh, he had a little cry on the air, and that's definitely something you don't want to do on the internet. Like the only time you're allowed to cry on the internet is if someone just died. And like you're like no, I I will be fine. And then you get into the stream and something triggers and you start fucking crying. You're like, and oh, that's if know, you're a woman. That's that happened to me. And that's that happened to me with woman. Harley. Like I literally found out she died like minutes before the fucking stream started. You didn't cry. You know you didn't cry. I, like I let that. out a tear or two, manly tears, very manly. You didn't cry like that. manly no, tears. This man was clearly a single... openly sobbing. He was sobbing with his head in his. And yeah. I can't do it anymore. I'm working oh. too hard. Wang, wang, wang. I feel bad. For, I'll be honest. I feel I bad do. for him. Like I understand people are fucking struggling now. He's probably I going through personal stuff too. I, I also know five. how the internet works. You don't show. We, you don't put blood in the water. So I told Lucas earlier. Is like, if you gotta bleed, go to the shore. Because uh, there'd be sharks out here, and they smell that blood that? miles away. It, it, what did I say? I, I smell mean, blood. Let's fucking it? go. I guess I could pull it up. It's not really. I'm not watching my own time, so if you don't want to watch, you're gonna, you're gonna watch, watch in your it. own time, Kyle. You're gonna do things, Kyle. <laughs> it is ridiculous. Yeah, perfect for the show. And I, I know he's disabled or whatever, and. He's like, oh, I do five podcasts a week, and then I DJ, and I found out I had to do two DJ things next week. My body's failing me. Ah. Poor guy. He's a DJ. You're bad. Dick, <laughs> like a nightclub DJ? Fuck you. My back's failing me. My back's I'm failing me, fucking, too. Uh, my I'm legs. still doing all my shit. You yeah. know what fail to your filters fail your teeth. My tits? Teeth. Teeth. My teeth. teeth. Whatever you did, the filters, it looks like you have like Japanese opium smoker teeth. <laughs> oh, I I just started drinking fresh tea. Maybe I stained the shit. Maybe I used too many tea bags. 
I've done that before, and it's I, my I teeth. think it's the theater, like the, the, the front is yeah. like really. I would theater. say I would say one tea bag is enough. You shouldn't have had multiple tea bags. Four, had four tea bags in your life. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, Stop me says he also has MS. Yeah. It, it, I oh yeah. Back to my question: Is he a, a music DJ on nightclubs? Oh. I, I guess something like that. I don't know the specifics, but I would assume probably like a bar or like maybe like a strip yeah. club nearby or something. I mean, he must be sitting down. He have he has MS. He can't be standing for too long and stuff. You know what I mean? He must hate Actually, going to you know, that baseball means he's games. Getting you know that means he's getting government money too. Probably. I mean, that's probably why he streams because I his fucking disability is not to pay for shit. A week and two DJ things plus I get a check from the government. Yeah, I, mean, I have got no dude, I, I've grown up around disabled people my whole life, so like there is there is a range where you're like, well, you could be making money. And then yeah. there's also the range of like, I don't know how you pay your bills. Like you just seem like you're in constant agony. The other thing is like I, I rarely watch this show. Like I've seen it a few times. I've seen that guy on there before. <laughs> and that was when he was not on, on the same place as Aaron. Mm -hmm. I always thought he was a wheelchair. The first time I ever saw him to uh, get up was to go to cry. Uh, yeah. Both of them cry. Both of them. No, no, just just Johnny. No, I don't think Aaron. Oh, Aaron done, didn't cry. Who cried? No, but uh, the, Aaron the just kind of uh, you know, we go do guys, and it's like I I understand, like you don't want to you don't want to fucking get Mersh mad at you too, but like. Your co-host is breaking down on the show. Like, you need to, like, step in at some point, right? Like... I don't know, Till. If you were crying because somebody <laughs> called you unfunny mm -hmm. as one of your co-hosts, I would literally tell you, stop being a pussy. I know you would. That's right. why I like you guys. <laughs> that's, why, that's why we're friends. Because I, I know you guys have no fucking tolerance for that shit. And I and it's this whole like don't cry and you know, yada yada. It's yeah, it's gay, but it's worse for the fact that he claims to have like a shitster radio show, like a O and A style show where we yeah, shit on the yeah, news, yeah. we make fun of. Uh, so, buddy, he mentioned you're that in the wrong times. Uh, Kyle is he's like, oh, those that enjoy old school radio. That's what Aaron was saying. Yeah, <laughs> right. So do a new school radio. Do some gay got the gay ass shit. And then you can cry all you want. <laughs> I don't know. As a man, you don't cry in front of people, let alone on the internet. Lucas, Lucas, I know you tried to, like, mix it up with some alts, but this is the worst alt I've ever seen. They literally used, you literally used the same. <laughs> no, I made you, like, a year and a half ago. <laughs> no, and it's like a, is, is that his 20th Signal account? Which Signal is like a... It's like a telegram for people who, who think the sun is watching them. That's the, Lucas, that's the it, laziest alt I've ever seen. No, 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 wow. that, that, that's the alt that tells him it's the end of the folder and he has to open up the new folder with the the uh, 21 through 30 alts. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty fucking... Unless somebody just stole that from him, that would be hilarious. That'd be even funnier if someone just stole it. All right, I'm not sure. I I don't have the exact um, timestamps, but I... it's right around like uh, 30 minutes. Yeah, that's right where I'm at. For a mistrial based on Daniel's testimony. I don't give a shit about Trump. Off for a minute and just let the court do its job. Uh, Cocktail says, "Let's talk about our fuck." Uh, Aaron, did oh, you take changed. down? Is that what was behind your thing? Yeah, he's changed his whole setup now. Or did he move it completely? Because he he told Jesse that there there was a room behind him, behind that screen. Like I don't know what this thing is behind you. It's something else. Yeah, I mean, I get making yourself a show logo, but oof. Maybe somebody Steel made that for them. With, I don't know. Maybe I'm just being mean wire. to a, a fan. This or looks something. like 
compared to what I, the little I have seen of his show before, mm -hmm. this look, if you just showed me this, I was like, oh, this is how he started, like, five years ago, yeah, right? the old studio. Yeah, yeah, that's, what yeah. Kind of, that's what I was kind of thinking, but it could be that he just moved his shit around, maybe they flipped the desk or something. I don't know, but no, 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 because it looks like he has natural sunlight coming into the room now. Yeah, it looks like there's a window over there. I think that's a Fucked up economy left. and country. Never mind, let's worry about a porn star. Uh, the bad luck boy. Wait, is that the bad luck boys? Hold on a minute. Is that my Mersh? Go to channel. Is that? It certainly is. Well, wow. You. Mersh with terse words hey, for Johnny. How going? much does the co-host job pay? Because this dude sucks. Well, how about you get fucked? Mersh doesn't like you, dude. Oh boy, Mersh doesn't we go. like me. I what am I gonna answer, do? Don't make me that mean, question that and answer. Yep. And uh, get no, no, Kyle, Kyle, watch where it goes to. Yep. He gets so sad. I would have just been like, D's nuts is how much you get paid. And then you grab Aaron's balls just to make Dude, you stare at the camera this... while you do it. This is, this is one of the best meltdowns I've seen in a while. Imagine <laughs> if this fucking privileged cripple. Okay, because I could I could get fucked in the ass or whatever. I ain't getting no free money from the government. Imagine if this fucking do people get free money for cripple. gay sex in America? If you have AIDS, ah, yeah. oh, you're right, Kyle. You know what? I forgot about that. Program. No, if you're he right. got a, 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 a hundred, <laughs> if he got a hundred of the abuse I get on the first, just for the chat, for the chat. If he got a hundred of the abuse I get, he would kill himself. Wait, see if there's an R Johnny Cry Fitz. No, I don't think I'm going to talk shit about Brazil. No. <laughs> we didn't invent anything. Stop saying that. <laughs> Aaron, and, Aaron and April, well, Steel Toe in general, we'll just count everybody in there. They do get an inordinate amount of hate for how, like, they're not a small show, but, like, they're not a huge show either. Like, their amount of, like, trolls and haters is very disproportionate to their number of viewers, I think. Yeah, I don't know, man. No, they, they, they dumb. I think the reason is because of Steel Toe. Or not Steel Toe, um, Red Bar. Because Red Bar... No, they... Red Bar fucking... Like, he doesn't mean... He's, like, he's not trying to do this, I guess you'd say. It's just an effect of the type of show he has. Where people see Red Bar making fun of Aaron and April. And they go and do it. And then a lot of them, though, aren't funny. They're just you know, a little touched by the angels, you could say. And so they take things a little far, like... No, that's and, and it's why that, too, is because day. he made a show, and mm -hmm. that's why he deserved, he deserved this. His show, still told, he made a show specifically for the ONA subreddit. Yeah, kind of. Okay? Yeah, and, and so you... So he, you, uh, he, if he doesn't know how to, rant, how to handle that shit... You those sorts of people... Exactly. You get those sorts of people. So, but it's still a very inordinate amount, like percentage-wise, of people that are there just to troll and hate watch. Like for how small a show he is. Like even like ROTC, like even Merch doesn't get like near as much shit as Steel Toe does. Because he's not. Again, is his show is specifically tailored to the O and A expats. Yeah, I get that. I get what you're saying. Just as Red Bar. Bunch of Red Bar fans, O and A people. Yeah. So if you wanna if you wanna tread in those those lands, you water, you be ready. Water, if you want to swim in infested like, water, you better be ready, baby. <laughs> is like is that shit talking about other people? Like O and A is well, that what that is? Or O and A yeah, was the yeah, Opie, right, and, Opie and Anthony subreddit, and they kind of garnered like a troll following. Which I mean, that's that's mm. kind of what young uh, which is, males which like is to even, do is fuck with people. You know what's even oh yeah! Is Toasty grew up in New York? <laughs> yeah. Hey, Eric, is that yeah, it? Eric? Uh, is that it? You, you, you guys yeah. missed yesterday, but she let out real quick, and most people just didn't catch it that she never watched The Simpsons. I haven't. I've seen like one to episode. Toasty, the radio sh show is based out of New York, so you would have had it on the radio for the past. 30 fucking year or actually yeah yeah 80 it was on 40 fucking I don't, it was years. on terrestrial then it went to serious oh so i never I, really i've I never heard of them until you guys mentioned them they're responsible for a lot of uh bill burr and like louis ck 
and Patrice hey, O'Neill. Patrice like, O'Neill. I would, like, I would they, did, they I would, didn't build, and, they didn't make them, but they like. Shot them into superstar, like when they were young. Okay, so you know Anthony Cumia, Compound Media. Anthony Cumia, you know the guy likes underage women. He's the ant. He's the A of O and A. Both, oh. both. And you remember that guy and... that just streams from the beach and doesn't really talk about anything other than like how like the the, the old days were better. That's that's Opie. The ROTC the old... guys, the ROTC guys, would both say if there wasn't any Opie and Anthony, there. They probably won't exist. I'm sorry. They, they've said it before. They've said it as fans while they pick on Opie and Anthony. He's going, you know, props to these guys. Their influences to the ROTC guys. Their influences to Yeah, a they influence a lot, like most people. Same as like Howard Stern. As much as we might yeah. fucking shit on Howard Stern, guy no. had an influence. Howard Stern was an influence on them. Yeah. Right? Uh, um, my well, I mean, He's still going, so the influence is still there. He's been an influence on multiple generations of, of broadcasters. Basically, Howard Stern was the king of radio back then when Op Opie and Anthony were coming up. Of course, they were influenced because I think it was like late 80s, early 90s. Yeah. And then they didn't get traction until the late 90s. And oh, then by, the, by the way, the, here in Brazil, the biggest radio show... Which I was mentioning yesterday, we had a we had a, a one of the biggest radio stations, right wing bases, a bunch of Jews. They were the O and A of Brazil, the Hispanic, Benico, whatever. Okay. They were the O and A of Brazil. They just took it. We'll see. They, they were the biggest. Antonio and e Antonio. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Antonio e Antonio. That's that's the Brazilian. Uh, it's a Brazilian Opie Anthony. Well, Kyle, what got O and A? I assume Brazil has an to... Antonio. That sounds like a Brazilian name. What got Opie and Anthony? Oh, to my dad's Spain called Antonio. Is they were the first <laughs> ones. They were the first guessing. ones to be a radio show. That's where they my were... son's middle name, by the way. That's see that every that's every Latin <laughs> loves an Antonio. Yeah, 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 can you fucking talk. Can nobody hear me? Welcome yeah, to we can world, hear you. Eric. We're just stuck okay. on the Antonio thing. Okay, wow. all right, go ahead. Sorry, Eric. Right, so like, See, now you know how I feel. <laughs> OB and, and Anthony's And my son's grandfather, they, too. What they got. Nobody cares, Toasty. <laughs> shut the fuck up. You're a woman. Only speak when spoken <laughs> Eric, to, okay? I call Antonio so you can't speak. <laughs> Eric, you, okay, go ahead. you know how we bring this segment full circles if, if you made one of the other people on the panel cry? <laughs> Don't cry, Eric. <laughs> oh, I feel bad for Johnny, but dude, you can't be doing that shit on the internet, man. Uh, yeah, let's, that shit's let's, gonna haunt you. Let's go to him crying. Hey, don't make me get in between the two of you. In between the two of us, I don't give a shit. Me I've been. Too. That's not a gay. <laughs> don't make me get in between you. Mouth open and butt agape. <laughs> yeah, really. Holy shit! How did you bring Andrew, it? Why'd you say though? that? Why would you say That's something a, so homoerotic? I well, I've never heard anything <laughs> so gay as between us, mouth open and agape. <laughs> what the fuck is that? And where have you ever heard it? I was just picturing like <laughs> someone making themselves into a, a a human finger trap. Mouth I don't know why I had to make it gay. Agape. I'm just trying to make this fucking awful event funny for it, myself. It, it really is kind of like a Shakespearean way of saying it, though. <laughs> Mouth open. You fucking came put to me, me in a lot of work and helping and out with a lot of shit. How much does the most of this job oh. suck? Oh, that's, no, all have, that's all we want out of our women. Dude, he has like Ethan Klein's face. I can't stop staring at him. That, that's why Till has a master's in screenwriting and language, so he no, can say too. things like that. <laughs> Aaron, you have such a like a. You know what Aaron Aaron's face reminds me of? Like this is what, when I see his head, because like the way he he's got that like that that widow speak. He looks like. If you gave him like a powder and like a uh, like a, a shiny cape, he could be like a bad guy in like like a eighties like space B movie. <laughs> I, I am the emperor of space. I would Aaron say an extra in a Tim Burton's Batman movie. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh shit, we got a dono. Zen underscore Rhino executed a lobster with one dollar. Don't spend it all in one place. Well, thank you kindly, Zen Rhino. Microwave. And y'all can be like our good friend, Zen Rhino, by Microwave. hitting that super chat button. Hitting those links Microwave. down in the description, or better yet, go to locals and sign up for our locals. A whole lobster for a dollar? That's that's like I'd buy mini that shrimps. for a dollar. God, I kind of look like that guy too. <laughs> if I had the glasses. That's a crawfish. Uh, come on, Zen Rhino. Fucking pissed. Uh oh, <laughs> the tiny like, oh you want to just fucking come out at me? You want to speak come on it for what? Speak I'm being, on it. I'm not. Let it play. Let I, it play. I love Aaron. Let, let, but... let it play. Come on, we're about to see him. I, I love Aaron, but that's just. <laughs> you know how like your friend does something that you're just like. It's kind of that's kind of gay, but you just like want to pat well, yeah, him on the shoulder. Like, I understand. Face right there, look at Aaron's <laughs> face right there. That's exactly Dude, what that's saying. Johnny looks like he could be fucking singing for a goddamn punk rock band or a fucking new metal band. <laughs> Mercy, you could suck his our complexion dirt. a little bit like you guys called the uh, like the hill people appellation. I don't know. Well, just fucking red redneck. No, 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 no. The, the hills people, what do you guys call it? Like, hillbillies, like, red. rednecks? No, not hillbillies or rednecks. I'm, I'm talking about the people, it might not people. even be hill. Inbred people. The they caucus? Their families. Mountain? They their families. That's the what caucus? Mountain people. Yeah, caucus? mountain people. Mountain. I mean, they're okay. from Minnesota. But in America, so yeah, like Appalachia, me. whatever. Yeah. Not doing good enough for and you? Bad, yeah, Too hillbillies. fucking bad. I'm kind of, I don't know, working three jobs, helping a friend out. How about you go fucking suck a dick, you piece of shit? Oh, I'm not entertaining the guy who's so fucking drunk he's still up at five in the morning. Whoopity do. Did you send a rant against someone with whoopity do? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a very strong move. I mean, not honestly. A it brings the aggressiveness down by like three point where he's just like, yeah. all right, I felt like you were punching me in the face. And then it felt like you just kind of gave me a couple body shots. I feel like you lowered it to a woman with... too. It's like, all right, it doesn't feel like it's that serious. I feel like he should have ended with cocksucker. Not whoopity do. He's proving his point. It, it, it sounds like I said something wrong to Ray. He's stupid. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm using AI. Um, I try to correct Ray on something. <laughs> Ray, using, next I'm, time you finish it with whoop de doo <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, whoop de doo <laughs> whoop de doo you mud hut nick. <laughs> Actually, Kyle, if you finish it, the argument with that, he won't know what to fucking think. He's like, how does this Brazilian even know whoop de doo <laughs> how, did he, how did he gain this power? How do you say that in Portuguese? It's not a word that translates. Yeah, it's, it's not, not a real word. Three <laughs> sandwich for two dollars, and I can't watch Steel Tone anymore. Every other sentence out of his mouth is begging for money. It's fucking disgusting, especially when everyone is broke. I completely understand, and I appreciate those two dollars. Microwave. Word. There is your microwave, my friend. Microwave. Microwave. Yeah, I know times are tough for everybody. That's why, uh, you know, I'm just mean, gonna focus on making a good show. Fucking poor. Once I figure Bruce that Yenward out, maybe is, a, is a real one. He, he always be dropping, he always be dropping donuts. So you've been promoted yeah. to shiny N word. Mm. Glistening oh. N word. Mm? Rumble. That's one thing you should uh, you should do is allow people to change their usernames. Because, like I said, I've been working a lot. And I am getting sick of people like, oh, this guy's not doing a good enough job. Well, who fucking gives a shit? I'm doing the best I can for everything I've got to do. I've got to do his show three days a week. i got to do my show five days a week. And now I'm DJing two days a week to make fucking ends meet. So how about if you don't like it, you don't fucking watch it. Oh, this dude sucks. None Fuck of those off. are a real job. I'm giving away old bits and sub shirts today if anyone wants to throw in 20 bucks. <laughs> you know. I just say, Johnny, I, I completely understand. I do, I do totally understand. Like, I do this shit six days a week, and I work like 45, 50 hours at a real job, and it sometimes feels like it's still not enough. But that's just the way mm -hmm. the fucking economy is now, unfortunately. And mm -hmm. you can't let that shit get to you, man. Like, I know it's easy to get bogged down in negativity and letting people make jokes. You know what? You should just learn. Like, we all, I think, can learn to laugh at ourselves a little more. 
He doesn't have any Irish in him. Is that what it is? No Irish. Hey, Southern mean. girl. Hey, fed up Southern girl. Prize closet, and I found some cool shit. Just wanted to, just wanted to give you guys something nice. <laughs> Balls and wieners. Okay, psycho. <laughs> no, that's um. You pay five monies. Just you, five monies. You pay five dollars. Did, just did, to, did they pay five monies, dude? Like I said, I'm getting fucking. Just here, we're gonna let dude? you vent. We're gonna let oh, you. This is. I didn't even, what are you doing? Uh, hey, not. Uh, okay, okay. What are you doing? I didn't notice this before when I. Okay, it wasn't even Mersh's comment. It's he was so broken up emotionally that when Aaron said five monies. That was the point. He couldn't take it anymore because he was being so stupid. Even you, Brutus. <laughs> Damn. Are you leaving? You taking a break? Yeah. Like Holy a shit. For those of you who like Wait, the old did school I hear radio him grab stuff. His crutches? Was that his problem? <laughs> yes, yeah. That was a quick, 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 quick. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Mercy oh, Farner. <laughs> I always pictured him like if he wasn't in a wheelchair, he was like Tiny Tim in a Christmas Carol with the two <laughs> arm crutches. Three, All right, let's see. Let's see what uh old Sunno has to make for us. I feel like Johnny needs a, a punk song. Like in in times like this, I just I look at the person and go, "You need some punk rock in your life." Fuck yeah. Like it's it's one of, like I understand like the fucking like just the build up the build up because I don't think this was all this just was Mersh, like I think Mersh and this other guy were just the cracks in the dam that broke it free, you know? Yeah. So it's like I feel bad for the guy, but still, Johnny, you can't be doing this, man. You can't be doing this on air. Like you gotta you gotta keep this shit offline because they will fucking tear you apart like piranhas. Yeah. But there is a way around it. Just start not giving a shit. Like, truly. Not not pretending to give a shit, but like, truly don't care. Meaning when someone makes a joke at your expense in your chat, or in Steel Toast chat, laugh about it. Riff with it a little bit. Unfortunately, when you're a guy, you can't do that on the internet. You can't live stream yourself. You know. Yeah, if you're a girl, though, you'll make a ton of money. Yeah, they make fun of you, but if you're a girl, then people feel bad for you, and you know. It's but that's different. reality, because your girls are defenseless, yeah. and men supposed to suck that shit up. The AI spit out one called Nine to Five Struggle." Let's hear what it says on. Man, the the, the novelty really wore out to. Just yeah, a mumbo song and whatever I can barely understand. I heard crutches. Well, I mean, that's just, that's how punk rock sounds. It's just, uh, yelling yeah. and noise. But, but it, you can hear the song, I don't know, it's just a, a mesh of... Yeah, that one, that one was a little, uh, little... All of them are, like... Cluttered. They, they have this, this smear... It's like a reverb smear on the whole thing, which is like... Mm. Whatever. Fucking dick. Bad luck boy <laughs> says, I commend your work ethic, but you suck. He's come back and yell at you again. Gonna fuck your shit up. Kids says Kyle is so jelly of AI. <laughs> Wait, did he say uh, he's going no, to... No, I don't care. Johnny it's going that... to come back and yell at him? Little did he know. <laughs> Little mm -hmm. did he know. <laughs> I hope so. Yeah. Is that the my pillow guy in the background? Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's not. Uh, uh, Ken, it's not that I'm jealous of AI. It's that every incompetent, uncreative, pale wannabe artist. It's like oh AI oh because you I just have like no it talent. because I so can really I get it. Type of I get it. So you don't, you don't, people, it's the Dunning Kruger just... effect. If you have no talent, you can't recognize talent. So whatever garbage mm -hmm. AI makes, it's like oh it's, it's as good as anything. Can Fucking someone put idiot. that? Send it to the Kyle uh, Reddit, <laughs> please. Please. <laughs> I mean, that's I, been I agree, Kyle. That's not as good as like actually making a song yourself. But the difference is, I can literally on the fly type in a song about Kyle being mad about AI, and I'll have 
You yeah, know. if you don't know the difference between all of these generic ass bullshit AI songs and songs made by people, that's the reason you're not a musician. Wait a second. That's the I'm reason you never got anywhere. I'm gonna bring this full circle. Yep. circle. I'm gonna bring this full circle. That's it. Hey yep. Kyle, do you know how Anthony Anthony Akumia uh first met Opie? Is because he was that doing was a parody song that Opie was in charge of a radio show in Boston that wanted parody songs and Anthony and his brother came in there with a parody song and got and the whole thing started off of that. No AI, Kyle. Right? No AI. I gotta be honest with you. I like to see my guys fired up like that. I yeah, don't like fired up. to see, like, again, I don't mind if people say I suck. I don't mind if people say anything sucks. I just, you know, whatever. But for some people, like Johnny said, you know, Man, he's working work his fucking line, balls man. off, you know, trying to, trying to keep her going. And then someone just tells him, throws in five bucks and says he sucks. That's going to upset him as a host. I'm torn because I want to see my friend uh, happy, but I also want to run a show where we can delve into something like this and see where it can go. Mic check. Yo, what yeah, up, Ray? Thank you, bad luck, boys. You want, for Hi, so your co-host to not Let's be go to the phones. Hello there. What... Take a... No, you're too loud, Ray. Can you lower that, please? You can't take a super <laughs> fucking chat that says you suck. Just right. a yeah, it's, it's a radio it's show. Sa it's sad. Like, you, you hate it when you... Someone you you like cracks, you know. Mm -hmm. Well, it happens I guess that I guess that toe isn't made of steel. Are you saying <laughs> that's a damn polymer? He should have wore a steel toe boot on his heart. It's a crooked toe. That seriously <laughs> is a folly. Uh, Mrs. Portland says I didn't like Johnny at first, but he grew on me a lot. I hope he comes back. That's oh, not a great it. compliment. I don't know if you guys know. Like, I'm terrible at taking compliments. But, like, saying someone, yeah, I didn't like you at first, but you grew on me. That's not a that's not a great compliment. Just tell them that you like no, them. I, I, I grew up like when you like insult. a tumor. Like a tumor? Yeah. So you so pretty. It's not a tumor. <laughs> yeah, Toasty, I didn't like you at first, but you grew on me. Oh, like a word. <laughs> See great. how fucking that stings? Yeah. You're like, oh, thanks. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> yeah, well, some, right? some people are ugly, and then you find out they have a personality. Yeah. It's true. It happens. No, no, Ray, what it is is they find What's out that? you were always right. Mmm. Mmm. I'm going to have a drink. I don't feel comfortable with you making those noises, Ray, and not having your camera. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm, in, mm. I'm in the middle of mm. rearranging everything. Mm. The, the camera will be back soon. I finally got the mic hooked up. Mm. Sounds okay. like you're edging. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> Man, Joe says, what is wrong, Merch? Can't use I'm a drunk for every, an excuse for everything. Well, look, he came back. Look it. Mrs. Portland asking you shall he, receive. He, he crawled oh, by the back way, even pig. 200. Oh, for a second there. For a second there. Hold on. Right. Get Mrs. Portland. Here. I don't know if it's just my brain's cooked from all these years of watching this shit now, but I swear to God, I saw. <laughs> I swear, like on on the on the main screen, it looked like the motherfucker was wearing a yarmulke. I had to look at the big screen, like, uh, no. no, that dude needs an insurer. <laughs> Man, look at his arm. Right, if he, he had a yarmulke, uh, he wouldn't be in he this. He has. Uh, <laughs> what well, is it? Multiple sclerosis or whatever. Multiple sclerosis. Scoliosis? Sclerosis. No, sclerosis. 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 Scoliosis. Sclerosis. Cirrhosis. There's too many. He got that scoot scoot disease. No, you know, you know what happened, Ray? Exactly. Is when he was young, his father never made him mow the lawn, and he had a weak fucking back because of it. That that's dude, what he did. Dude, I got off my <laughs> tractor to come in here and yell at y'all. Wouldn't that be great if that was what all <laughs> multiple sclerosis was? Somebody didn't yeah, do him just the weak ass lawn would it make mowing me skinny? Kid? Would it make me skinny? I wish uh, I had it. You like gotta your, get a push mower. Your I mean, parents never sent you out to uh, 
pull the weeds or anything. Yeah, that's yeah. what happened with Stephen Hawking. <laughs> he never mowed the lawn. <laughs> my my aunt has MS, and I I saw her a year or so ago. She was in a wheelchair, and then when I went to my grandfather's funeral a few months back. She was up and walking again. And she's like, I don't know what happened. I can just walk again. And we're like, cool, Aunt Tammy. <laughs> like, give her like a big old hug. She started taking steroids. Dude, that would be like, crazy, right? She, she starts yoked. getting ripped Kevin at has like MS. 60. <laughs> like, like, oh. it, it, wait a second. In Pet Cemetery back in the 80s, you know, the original one, wasn't the sister that was all creepy and everything, the sister of the wife in Pet Cemetery? Didn't she have like, Multiple uh, sclerosis, or I whatever. don't remember. Pet I, I think and, so. and that's why she had some weird crazy, disease. Crazy, weird looking. I just remember the truck accident, and that was about <laughs> it. Like, I don't really remember that movie. That, that's honestly. when you checked out. I about eight years ago, like, I like I like uh, the Dark Tower series mostly. About eight years ago, I went, Oh, Stephen King's kind of a hack. Mm -hmm. Oh, took it that long to realize that? Yeah, really. Come on. <laughs> it was almost a decade ago. It was when I was in jail and I was reading Bag of Bones, and I went, "This reads like a TBS, like made-for-TV movie." I was and, dumb. I was stupid, and I read The Dark Tower, and I read a bunch of other stupid. But the, the Dark right. Tower, I will say, The Gunslinger might be, as far as I've read, his best book. It the, reads that, like a Tarantino the, what movie. What they tried to do with the movie, right? With oh, each Zelda? Oh, no, 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 yeah, no, I, I didn't like the movie. Like it that was movie. just a failed run at the tower. <laughs> Ray, uh, how many all. books? <laughs> how many books is the Dark Tower? I think Seven. I only read two or three. Technically eight. Yeah, thank God I realized. So. Right, Holy hey, shit! Wait, put it this way, Ray. What's my that? mother was a, a fan of Stephen King, and she even has like I think the Dark Tower <laughs> books when they came out originally in yeah. hardback. And mm -hmm. she said that movie sucks. <laughs> mm -hmm. And the, I like the Idris early, Elba, but I was like, "What is happening?" The early books in the Dark Tower series, like the first like four, are really fucking good. Yeah, like his that's his dialogue I... though, his dialogue sounds like someone's writing for a TV movie. That it mm -hmm. always does every time. His dialogue just sounds so fucking robotic. All you well, gotta know probably... is that Stephen King hated. The movie Shiny, and then he made that fucking stupid series terrible that looks like a fucking <laughs> soft oh, porn. Wait a second. We haven't even gotten to him crying. Come on. We got to stay on topic. We, I know. We still got to get the Hormax for tonight. I've got and some crazy shit about shall Hormaxer. Receive. About a little teaser for later. Hormaxer finally finds his girl for his porno. Oh, no. Heavy emphasis on the. Oh, is it <laughs> <to try laughs> even yes, Kyle? He finds a trap two hundo away mm. from today and uh, 30 but minutes of it, overtime. It got, Can you believe all deeper. this excitement? We're only a half hour into today's show. Anybody who wants go, to call me as like soft as a piece minutes. of fucking. Yeah, fucking he's still there. Like it gets better. Oh, see, now he's starting. Oh, 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 hey, hey, no spoilers. Oh, yeah, he's starting yep, yep, yep. right there. Pays yeah. five dollars to make you say it. Like that's the thing. I have uh, subreddits. He paid $5 yeah. to call me and, a buddy. Uh, Does he cry like Chewbacca? Oh. Dude, at oh. one point, he literally has his head in his hands he does. sobbing. <laughs> I felt bad for him, but the entire time I'm just going, oh, Johnny, you can't be doing this. I was laughing. <laughs> Dude, imagine if Johnny was Brazilian. He would fucking kill himself with the fucking chat. Like, every day there's like five <laughs> fucking Brazilian, he'd probably rednecks been, you know. fucking obsessing over me. What is it the Spartans did when the baby was defective? <laughs> yeah. This, this Nobody all thinks about you, Brazil does that. <laughs> you take a bomb, you All, all know, their you hospitals know. are weirdly on cliffs. <laughs> Not only talk about the fact that I suck fucking cock all the time, that I'm fucking terrible. Right. Uh, <laughs> Again, with this gay, these gay confessions. Kind of Aaron, I love you, buddy, but you gotta stop with this. <laughs> you guys... Stop with these phrases. No, no. And you yeah, and I get shit on them out of context. And I feel no. like I get shit on more than anyone. You know what? Notice he didn't say that any of them say that he is unfunny. 
Uh, just two quick I questions. Need, what is his name? Is Aaron? Aaron? A A R E R E N? I have no idea. Yeah. Yeah. Aaron. It's Aaron. And he lost a lot of weight, right? I remember like seeing before the the goatee, he was chubbier. He lost a yeah, I don't know. Like, who knows? We're not he's, women. He's we a... don't pay attention to that shit. Man. Not in a good know. way. Not like losing weight because he's I... going to the gym. No, it's we're, probably here, some... we're here to see the other man cry, not talk about the weight loss of Aaron. It, it's them skinny arms. I get it. I'm it's, jealous. It's odd. I wish I he's had He's a nerd. Arms. What do you expect? We're all nerds, know. Eric. You're on no, the internet, so you're a nerd by no, association. No, we're ah, not all take nerds. Take that, Eric! Exactly. I at least have some muscle in my body because I've done manual labor the majority of my life. I'll you're a manual take some labor MS nerd. if I could get the norms like that. Crab slap Henry says he lost about 120 pounds as in April. Mm, oh, that I don't fucking, believe the rumors that, that she left. I believe... I, 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 I believe it's coming. Hey, honestly, wow. she should. Because <laughs> this guy, is, she is way out of his league. <laughs> I, I don't know. Their foreheads are it... compatible. She's no. stepmother. She doesn't <laughs> no. have any kids with him because I think she's barren. Right? Is that what it is? I'm pretty sure she's barren. I heard that. Somewhere. I don't know. I don't care. I'm saying it. I'm so not going to A-log these people. All right. Hey, the more we focus on Aaron, the le and the less we focus on his oh uh, my God, crying, crab the slap him. Hold on, on, Eric. I'm sorry to cut you off, but crab slap him or just pointed out something that I didn't think about. You notice anything missing? No. Dignity. Oh, oh, a mirror, um, a wedding ring. I mean, that doesn't necessarily Has he ever mean won anything. One? Was he married? I have to no her? idea. <clears throat> yeah, he's married. Or Abel. is or. Okay. I've never worn a wedding ring. <laughs> Matt feels like you guys sick of hearing him back. Come on, I want to see the <laughs> she guy would do it too. She was at a pawn shop, Ray. What's that? I said, of course you don't have a wedding ring. You sold it at a pawn shop. Yeah, th that's what I did. <laughs> Come on, you guys keep pausing right before the cum shot. Come on, let's go. You can see the either <laughs> we're, we're edging. You got to edge. These are Eric places like, that uh, I'm. I'm getting divorced and April's dead or April's not in the house or, uh, oh. I, I don't remember anyone ever saying April's dead. Do you guys? You don't follow his social media. Yeah, Who I mean, I, I don't follow his AWOL. So maybe know? that's the thing. People are saying he killed April, but I'm just like. I only saw it I whenever bring that you up, posted period. it. I wouldn't bring that up, period. If I, if I were you, Aaron, just stay away from that. We don't want you don't want another uh JF uh situation on your hands. We don't need we don't need mama steel toe going missing. Yeah. Might need after this dude starts fucking weeping. Here's one from the last six months. Nick Ricada and I are fucking each other. Right. Uh is one I've read over and over. Uh fucking each other's wives, uh fucking this one. person, fucking Heard Gino, those. Keanu, fucking them all day Heard long. That. Just apparently, Who's I'm Keanu? slaying pussy. Uh, Gino's wife or girlfriend. Oh, okay. Wait, really wait, wait. nice. Is I was on her show. Is he about to take the glasses off and start crying? Come on, let's keep um, going. And, and April's doing this and April's doing that. I, I just... It, at Hello, some point... And I, I don't know, maybe I'm just... Maybe I've been doing this too long. At some point, it all just becomes noise. Well, and it doesn't matter. Wait. Is he really crying, or so I, I do this sometimes, I or yeah, is his eyes crying. burning? He's got, yeah, he's got allergies. He's, he's got allergies. Because it's humid. Because as someone with glasses, my eyes tend to burn. Or no, 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 no. I'm going to no. make him look cool here. No. no, see what I happened was Johnny went off camera and did like a shit ton of cocaine and came back. That's why his eyes are so fucking red, because he's got to the gills, and he's ready to fucking go. No, what he did was he went off camera and Johnny went to the, the snow bathroom, pony. splashed a bunch of water on his face and dried it off after he stopped crying a little bit. And now he's going to come back here and keep crying. <laughs> he already opened the floodgates. Yep, can't stop it after that, bro. Yeah, at that point, like if, you, if all I knew the I was emotions gonna, are about to come. If out. I knew I was getting really emotional and like I already got off camera, I would just come back and be like, "Hey, man, I don't think I'm gonna come back." But do you hear today. him cry? Does he sob? 
Oh, yes. Yes, he does. Keep okay. going. Yeah. I thought maybe it could have been, you know, his eyes bothering April, 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 this. It's 100%. so silly. Why? Uh, why can't people and, and I'm not blaming Why can't you. we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Because he's a homosexual and we don't mix like that. <laughs> Because it's the <laughs> internet and nobody are friends. Nobody are friends. And actually, in real life, yeah, you can call each other friends, but you're not really friends. <clears throat> not nowadays. If he would just, if he would just left when he when he took a break the first time, he could have at least left this with some dignity. Dude, I got oh pissed. The, I had to leave. The, I had to so step good. off. I didn't want to fucking ruin the show. Understand? Yeah. Is that what what he called his crutches? Dignity. <laughs> well, no, I'm, I'm not, why can't people let it go like i said it's just it's why, why can't we just be not, he tried to do the why can't like, we just literally on the ice show yeah i mean much. this guy like y'all go after people all the time too like it's, exactly. it's okay when it's when it's blown back on you just laugh and smile it wasn't it wasn't even that bad up. it's so weird really not just call people like gay. i said i don't think any of this had to do with with uh as Mersh. much as Mersh no, this guy, no, no, people no. are making out. This, this guy video. was mentally fragile. And oh yeah, he's having a bad day. Shattered the, shattered the glass. Yeah, <laughs> Mersh, Mersh just saw him looking over the cliff, and he went boop. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just if people are like fucking with you, just tell them to kill themselves. That's what I do. I call them the f word. I tell them to kill themselves. Yeah, but you're a woman, so you can get like away with that and shit. <laughs> huh? Like, we're, we gotta like deal with like real, like you know, real. Consequences. <laughs> I was gonna say, I, I want to say repercussions and consequences at the same time. So I came out as ripequences. Ripequences. <laughs> and I was like, that's not actually. Consequences. I, I know that ripequences <laughs> is uh, <laughs> dude. I, don't, I was gonna show you guys this is earlier. Eric July's new comic. Eric July is taking a big step back from the internet. Finally, he's is he, is he gonna run his million dollar business? Finally, I don't know. No, but, uh, of course not. I think I think that constitutes as a win. I'm gonna I'm gonna it, claim this handler. win on behalf of all the detractors. You think Eric he got July. scared of EVS's violence? Mm, now, Stir, just all the intention's gonna be on you, buddy. Ooh, you little stupid videos. Microwave. Mm, microwave. All right. I I also have to admit, after watching this, it was like because Mike did send like. I want to say three or four messages, super chats, and it was like he was playing Battleship, <laughs> and at the end it was like, "Yeah, Battleship sunk, Battleship sunk." You sunk, <laughs> you sunk my Battlestream. <laughs> yeah. I know I don't it's, do it's as kind well of weird. I've only watched this on audio. Well. I don't have viewers, other people facial have, reactions. But, <laughs> like I just, I try to just do a fun show. If you don't want to be part of it, fine. But people come in and oh, say I suck there, and they say I suck here. It's just right like there. I don't. I'm, yeah, if, if, oh, I, okay, I, he is. If I if there's ever anything in my life where I start getting like this on the stream, because I'm the person running the stream, I'm just gonna be like, guys, I got it in the stream. I I can't. Do I that would now. tell you. To I'd be like, no. Stream. I'd be like, you're a strong, independent woman, and you can <laughs> do this. You and I believe in you, and I'm gonna hold you up on high. I would say probably the hardest the hardest day I ever had to stream was like right after finding out that uh, Harley died. And it was like, damn, because like she was that was like early, early days, and she was like at every stream helping me figure all this shit out. How is and, Davidson ever gonna get mm, through this? Mm. Giving yeah. us topics to talk about and shit. Yeah, yeah but you know, know, we streamed anyways, and you know, talking about shit and you know, shooting the shit with you guys helped me get my mind off stuff. And I think we even did a little, you know, what do you call it? Uh uh where you you commiserate? You know, we, did, we did some commiserate com commiseration for Harley on that show too. It was a long time ago. I'm barely God, getting by, and I'm getting tired years. of people feel feeling like no one wants me around to do it. Like fucking Jesus, man! God damn it, bro! But again, I want <laughs> you around to do it. You've been <laughs> right. uh, I feel the like more is the more people Eric act like, like people. they don't want you there on the internet is the more you should become. Defiant of them. Fuck you. I'm here. Deal with it. 
suck my cock. Yeah, I'm right your here. Balls on the table, bro. I don't get so much anymore, but the start of the whole Air July shit, dude. I was getting fucking like the worst comments and shit on Twitter. People tell me to go fucking in myself and stuff like that, and I just laughed. <laughs> I'm like, I must really piss these people off. And it, that should make you feel good. I know when yes, people get did. really mad it at me, feel great. <laughs> it tickles my nipples because I'm alive what? and they hate that. What? No, you know why this guy's crying is because he's realizing he's a grown man with a five-year-old daughter and he... He has no a, job. <laughs> he has no job and he has a Deadpool t-shirt on where he choreographed I think I say dead legs. Uh, oh the my God, long uh, sleeve undershirt that he rolled up on his sleeves with no arms. Ray, well, I just uh, noticed your picture. Eric, that's actually a single don't, shirt. Don't incentivize him. That, that's, that's a single shirt. That's um, a single the, shirt. The long sleeves are sewn into the short sleeves. Yes, that's how those are oh. made. Oh. Yeah, those are single. You it's can't made even so it the two like, shirts to put it together? Well, it's, you know, you buy less shirts. And it's no, not that hot. that sounds stupid. I would not wear that. Well, you're also a construction worker that would probably push someone wearing a Deadpool shirt into like Well, I mean, some, I'm like, also puddle. Fuck, He's probably in his 30s. I wouldn't be dressing like that in the first place. I mean, I don't mind the occasional comic book shirt, but I, I feel like you gotta you gotta space them out. You can't just do them every day. People are gonna think you're fucking 12. No, I think uh, after you're fucking at least 30 to 33 years old, you should be wearing either button-down shirts, stripes, solids, <coughs> Flannel, something like that. I don't go. Well, I remember in high school, I was so fat that all I could really find as comfortable shirts were like solid sh color shirts. And so, yeah. uh, Eric, were all, were, were all those comments directed at Doctor Two? Yeah, most of them. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what I was thinking. Because <laughs> he's the only fucking other person on this show that doesn't wear adult attire. I wear adult attire all the time. No, you don't. I am you very, I'm very well dressed right now. Oh, this is I... the most adult why are you wearing you ever dressed. And this nice jacket wearing... is gay. Yeah, what? No, great. I like it. I like jacket. it. It looks good. Because I am a member of the You don't ride Shut up. motorcycles. Shut up, Kyle. I don't know, Eric. It just, looks uh, very nice. I just look so good. I can't help Hell myself. Hell yeah. Look, he looks like a Chad. Don't be jealous. Yeah, Shut up. You, you don't even want me to go put on the blue fucking leather jacket that matches my eyes and shit. I'm not, he, he looks like a to, gig. He's about to dance to kill him. You bought a leather jacket that matches your eyes? No, actually, I got it for free because this Italian guy fucking say he was like, I'm going back to Italy and it's going to cost me more to fucking um, pay for the baggage to ship all these things. Yeah. You want to just take them? And I was like, yeah, sure. <laughs> Jim Jazz says you look like Marty McFat. <laughs> yeah. Ah, you do. Or yeah. that looks like a gay, thriller. Uh, a gay guy it. named Chad. Uh, but it looks cool. I like this jacket. It's got like a inner. I love jackets with inner pockets. I all the jet. All my yeah, jackets. Tosi, uh, your shoulder is your idea of cool. Is it like eighty-five degrees where you're at? Why are you wearing a no, jacket? No, it's actually pretty nice. It's like 72. Was it hours. nice? The cold front yeah. hit y'all? Well, it, we've been getting a lot of storms. a tornado lately. last night. Oh, I know. I've been Dude, a tornado. They, it skipped us and went right to Hot Springs. I went, ha, 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 ha. Fuck you, Hot Springs. <laughs> <laughs> Eat a dick. So mean. A fucking <laughs> soldier the entire time. I'm happy with your performance. It keeps, like, and I'm right on the river. Like, right on the river. And so, like. Oklahoma's like a stone's throw away. And like mm. people across the river keep getting fucking dick slapped with tornadoes. And then people like further east from us keep getting dick slapped by tornadoes. I'm just like, hey, it keeps skipping us. <laughs> he fucks. That, that's not true. Right. It's part of the sport. It's so funny. What? He likes chicken? Whatever. It always does that. Yeah, play the Forbidden Disney cartoons. Get your old Jew books out. Whoa. Anyway. It's not it's not his show. Anyway. What is what does anyway. chicken have to do with Jews? It's just not funny. Let it sit. Let it sit, Kyle. I'm just you're just making me hungry. I made some delicious grilled chicken. I don't believe you made I those. I took a picture <laughs> right? of it. I do not believe you made those. Not one bit. 
Oh, I'll, to I'll come in see and see if they can uh, fuck you up a little bit, which yeah. is shitty, but it's it's part of the game. Like I said, I'm just I need a break. He has noticed this thing right behind him. Dad jokes. Pizza. He's got multiple editions of dad jokes books. Well, that's where he gets his material. Johnny, I know you you probably feel really embarrassed about all this, and you probably feel very bad about all this, but I want you to know this is a work of art. This whole thing. This is an artistic <laughs> presentation. Not what I'm doing. Just what y'all did on its own. It's it. I think that judge was wrong in this case. Alone. <laughs> this podcast is a work of art. I just like to say I'm not fucking Nick Ricada in the ass. Mouth or any other orifice. But is he fucking you? Yeah. Sorry, I'm going into the lobster mode. <laughs> That's it, is that, is that uh, better, Kyle? Look, man, I, I'll tell you that, this. That'll, this will make you feel better. Nah, of course you have a break. <laughs> Nobody here has ever asked for a break and not gotten one. That's making me less hungry now. Well, Kyle's <laughs> uncomfortable about something. I don't know what it is. I know you think it is because I, I don't care about the the swastik or the Jews. It's not about that. It's about it's not your show. Okay? Not my show. I'm not fucking fucking putting swastikas up on my screen thinking it's funny. That's it. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. Okay. There was Congratulations. Right. Fine. Was it behind the chicken? You saw what you wanted to see, bro. Uh, yeah, hungry. I'm some I'm a snowflake. Not nothing to do with that. Just respect for other people's. God damn shit. it! I got under your fucking skin, didn't I, bro? It's okay. I love you. You wish. I, I'm not you doing wish. shit, you Kyle. Wish. You started it. I was just enjoying the show. I change. I literally change it to my stupid fucking face because I don't have a camera right now. As it should have done. Yeah, or with the wall, but or whatever but else. I had that. <laughs> Fine. I don't know why you changed it. It wasn't fun. Because I was messing around. I'm not doing it. I still just That's think fine. about chicken. I'm hungry. Whatever. I am too. Can somebody get us chicken? Dude, I, I, I didn't hear any of that. I just, break, unmute yourself. I'm just trying to figure out where I could get chicken after the show. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I'm just like, is there a place nearby? I'm not a kid I'm either. Sure. I'm I'm really That's, hungry now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, sorry. I'm not gonna care about this shit. Uh, I'm my bad. No, I don't care. You're fine. My bad. You're fine. I was looking at, I'm looking at blueprints right now. So. <laughs> Oh, I'm just fucking weird? over here high and hungry and going, I could chickens I could fuck up some chicken right now. <laughs> no, I I I think I I think I, I remember what Kyle was saying because I think Ray did put two uh a bunch of chicken quarters and make a Nazi symbol on the ground. Yeah, I texted it to you like four months ago. Ray. I know. So yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure <laughs> when I, I was making chicken. Was so you actually did make chicken. Yes, and I thought yeah. it was funny, and we I was stop, like, "Holy, we stop talking about shit, chicken!" I, I'm I so on the fucking and I was hungry. Like, oh, that's funny. <laughs> I'm so fucking hungry. This, I, we can't keep talking about chicken. Okay, like it's, ma it's literally making today. my stomach like growl. You know, like it's like, like it, I'm I'm so hungry. I had fried chicken with fries. God damn it, Toasty! We can't keep talking about fucking and chicken. And a nice large homemade iced twee. An iced twee. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Hal, if you're out there, order me KFC. I'm fucking starving. <laughs> oh, that's not that's, chicken. Uh, it was my bad. Okay, it's I fucked enough. it up. I shouldn't care. Okay. I mean, you're not wrong, Kyle. We are monetized, and it'd probably be for our our benefit that we don't have hate symbols. So why don't on you the fuck show? say something, fucking fat? Because I'm stuck on chicken, dude. I'm legit fucking starving uh, over uh, here. Uh, 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 uh. I'm I could Kyle. See I, you, you think I'm kidding? I have to I'm be not. the fucking hound dog and then take it'll take all the shit. Kyle, you anyway, act like you get paid that's for why this. I didn't. No, nah, man. I just respect people's <laughs> shit. You know. Crab Slapper says Marty McFat says, Don't call me chicken, just call me some chicken. <laughs> Get that bitch delivered. All right, let's continue with this. Nobody's ever needed a minute, and I've said no. 
You know, April comes to me. She said, "It's and honestly, April came to me, and I kind and I noticed it as well. And it was <laughs> internet rumors, internet shit, this, that, the other thing. Um, I can't take it anymore. You know, I can't handle it. It's having a detrimental effect on my mental health. And I said, for God's sake, honey, don't do the show. If that if that's what it's costing you, do not do the show. I I don't value you as." That, that was a mistake. Stop talking about your relationship on the air. Like I've made the mistake before. Don't do it. It's not yeah, good. I didn't. I didn't want to be the one. To, I know. <laughs> to I, that's why I'm saying. I know from from fucking experience. Just don't do it. Like you're gonna feel like shit about it later. Yeah, every now I still hear shit about that one stream we did. <laughs> the uh, fun in the purse. <laughs> oh, dude, I think she's got a, that shit locked and loaded a good for friend. you. I never, and I said it before the relationship. I gave you the advice, and I never said I told you so. I never said it because you should have. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I've told Till. He just doesn't listen to me, just like about Twitter. So. Yeah. She's Art like, Thrasher says, sort of like the country. Steel Toe show. Who are these guys anyways? <laughs> right. um, this is a morning show. They used to be uh, a radio show that moved to the internet after they got canceled. So, Crab um, Slap had a good joke. It's like desperate house pods. Yeah. <laughs> it was way before, but it, it kept it ringing in my head. <laughs> Dude, I, I've been telling how for months now. Like, If Keemstar really wants to make a fucking shit ton of money, Get all these streamers' girlfriends and wives, throw them in a house and do a reality show. Real housewife of Real Housewives of YouTube, that show would fucking sell like crazy. Right? Am I wrong? Well, don't say that. Just marry Hal, and then you could gather up the the wives up, and you do it yourself. And she you would want to do. She'd murder all those bitches. Like, ah, oh, damn it, Hal's gotta go to fucking prison now because she killed all these stupid YouTubers' wives. Like, I, I don't disagree I with her. I do that, but I'm gonna have to marry someone. <laughs> Anyways, this is a... These guys are, like, our friends. And this happened this morning, and, uh... Another friend of the show, Mersh, from Nightwave and ROTC, um... Kind of set off a chain of events here with a few donos that... Ended with, uh, Johnny here in tears. As a co-host, the way I do as a partner or anything else. Same thing with you. Same thing with Corey. I don't value you people as entertainers, workers, broadcasters, whatever, as much as I do as, as friends. And I don't want to see this uh, break anybody. And, and certainly, look, the stress you're feeling is stress that I felt as well. Uh, with this you know, show going funny. through it changes. Like and it costs like and, and it the cripple. Yeah. Oh, yeah, boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come here, Johnny. You need a nice my hug pillow. Yeah. Causing, you know, issue. Uh, I mean, for years. I mean, that would have been honestly, Aaron. That would have been the funniest thing you could have done is just pull the my pillow from off camera and been like, "Here, Johnny, hold this." You'll yeah. Put <laughs> <laughs> Michael Lindell on his You're seat. You're right. I did so up. much better. <laughs> they used to have a sponsor, a sponsorship with uh, my pillow, and then something happened to where my pillow just went. No, we don't want you guys no more. Low numbers. No, it was it was something. Um, uh, Aaron, it's I don't remember the story exactly, but Aaron kind of burned that bridge, dude. And they were first like, of all, he's not. He's crying right in front of another man that is doing. Yeah, a if I'm show ever gonna cry in front of another man, I'm like, can you look over there, please? <laughs> <laughs> like my what's that behind like, you like i barely, <laughs> i didn't even cry when i almost had my arm sliced off because there was other men there <laughs> what the fuck I, I got ran over in high school and didn't cry instead i sat in the uh driveway and laughed hysterically for like 10 minutes like maniacal Dude, ran over by a bicycle because it was no so it fat. was a it was a john deere gator it ran over Dude. both my fucking knees. Both my assholes. nipple got ripped off and I didn't even cry. I just put a band-aid. Oh, God. Toasty always got to make about you. <sighs> so you I, so you I, so you only have one nipple? No, I have, I have both of them. But it's then she also got a cadaver was, nipple uh, put was, on there, so she has split. three. 
it was split, so I could see like the fat inside of it and all that. Yeah, yeah. dude, I but snapped my I normal. snapped my no. femur bone, and mm. when I sat up after falling, my leg on my left knee was bent outwards to the left. Like imagine sitting up and mm. your your leg is bent outwards to the left. I had to ride in the back of my buddy's pickup truck for him to drop me off at the hospital. I didn't cry because there was all other fucking men. Hit every bump on the way. <laughs> of course. <laughs> going through potholes on purpose. <laughs> I'm not crying. Sorry, I'm bud. Man. Sorry. Ah, oh, sorry. Oh, wait. Here comes the speed bump. <laughs> like, rev it up. <laughs> That's what it felt like. In We're the so back mean of the to each other. That, that's what it felt like yeah, in the you guys are the assholes. Ford Ranger pickup truck. <laughs> Dude was uh, ran over by a guy in rollerblades. No, I was run over by my brother. <laughs> Dude, this was like weeks too after. So the way our our, our Tim, lot this was set is up, cosmic energy working out. Because guess who broke my fucking femur bone? <laughs> Your brother. <laughs> <My> brother. <Yeah. laughs> Thank God I'm an only son. Well, there was a ditch had... that had that was up Go like ahead. several feet off the road, and we would jump that from both angles. And one night he jumped it from like behind the church, which was probably about 120 yards away. So he like sped up and jumped it. And when he hit the road, it ejected me and this guy named James, who's like this tall Filipino dude that was sitting in the bed. Holding onto a gun rack. And I get ejected out the side and he gets ejected over the front and like bounces off the front. And then like two weeks later, this motherfucker runs over both my legs and pressure fractures my right kneecap. Ooh, Jesus. Damn. Yeah, it fucking sucks. I was like, you gotta get away from these things. Brothers are assholes. Well, it was my it was my brother both times. My brother pushed me down the hill when I was eight and half my tooth chipped. Oof. I watched one time, though, my brother and my grandpa's field on a three-wheeler. This is one of the reasons why three-wheelers are outlawed now. He was doing donuts, and it jackknifed, and it flipped on him. And I watched this guy faceplant to a field with him. <laughs> three-wheeler. Three-wheelers are the best. And, and he got up, and he's just like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you try to be an asshole on, on the... a three-wheeler, they are unforgiving. I was standing on the porch watching it from like probably like two or three hundred yards away. And I'm just standing there laughing and he just left like he put the three wheeler back up right and then just left it there and walked back to yep. the house. Yeah, the walk of shame. <laughs> and my dad walks out and goes, it's wrong. <laughs> He'd seen it through the window. <laughs> and everybody inside was laughing at him. <laughs> Boy, you done <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> it was great. All right, let's finish. We gotta get the Hormaxer. The Zumok stuff. It's caused strife in my personal life. It's caused strife in my professional life. And it's it's a road I've had to navigate. I mean, you could argue that really since the start of my... That's like these 30 aren't people. seconds he's in the sad position. Yeah. Well, he was... I skipped ahead quite a bit there. It's not like yeah, you have Stanford good. graduate scholars who are analyzing your performance and going, well, based on the stern scale of, of good broadcasting, uh, his score is shit. These are retards who live to say everything sucks. Yeah, except my brain is breaking more and more, and then the more I try to fight him, the more I sound uh, stupid and retarded because I can't even keep my thoughts. Even more and more, dude. That's a woman thing to say. I'm sorry, that's a woman thing to say. <sighs> yeah, he's clearly not well, and he shouldn't be doing a, a yeah. radio jockey style show where this i think i think he has to uh, is that what he's paying his bills with isn't it and his dj and stuff yeah i guess Wait, he has disability Wait, are you Jax? telling me a guy in what is state minnesota minnesota mm -hmm. something like that and he has uh this disease i'm i'm basing this off the size of his wrists he, you, you're telling me he doesn't <laughs> get government no, 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 no right he has um <laughs> Multiple school roasts. Don't get MS. with that wrist phrenology, Ray. Let's so not start. Okay. We've already done the racist shit money? enough on the show today. Are you telling me a guy in a liberal state like Minnesota doesn't get government money for having MS? Uh, well, he is white. <laughs> I'm picturing like a Victorian doctor with like the little like you know Ray, <laughs> and, 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 as, as much as they mm. portray it that it works like that. <laughs> the fucking white people abuse. Oh the yeah, yeah, system I just know. as much. 
Uh, well, I didn't the speak- problem is multiple sclerosis is very treatable nowadays, and that's probably the issue why he's I've, not I've getting heard money. Him- Oh, I've heard him talking about too how like his treatments aren't really being very effective. Yeah, but well, yeah, that's well, the excuse also, the okay. government uses not to give you. There are treatments out there if you can afford them or not. And it doesn't matter when it comes to getting the grants because uh, uh, soldiers that lose limbs and stuff that's considered a treatable uh, fucking illness now, or yeah. not illness, but a disability. <laughs> Grow them back. Well, no, you they you can I get guess, a fucking no, prosthetic. <laughs> yeah, well, prosthetic. yeah, prosthetic. Hey. Multiple sclerosis yeah, yeah. is basically like the signals from your brain not making it correctly to your limbs. Is that what it is, or is that? I have no idea. I never looked it up. Like so I if, said, I, I just thought of this. It's some sort of spinal problem. So he needs I, a I new spine. Know. I say right now, we all dig deep down in our pockets and find Johnny a new spine. So, so Neil's saying that like on ch- that during that this Jack was like Chat was like uh fucking gassing him up or was like a hug box or whatever it was. Yeah. They were trying to like, you know, comfort the dude and for him to still be doing this is even I don't know if it All makes right, it better. Okay, no, 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 okay. So no, MS- here, here's my argument about it. shut up, Toasty. Nobody wants to fucking hear you. Every time I keep talking, you fucking try to keep speaking. I'm done with this shit. I'll have to fucking yell over you. You're just trying to make her cry. Toasty, Toasty's X Ray. <laughs> Toasty's X Ray. <laughs> he doesn't speak him. Shut up. <laughs> all right so all right this guy has a five-year-old daughter i heard him say it mm. so your back was fine five years ago you were able to fucking make a child what happened because i mean she my left back him. hurts i can't have sex that's an argument <laughs> i guess <laughs> <laughs> stupid you can fuck all right we, one day we gotta fuck. get to the end of this guys what the fuck you can make it I think we're going to go along. Hit that like button, y'all. Share this thing on all your favorite social media. After this, we're getting into Hormaxer and his plans for his new porno with his new girl. So, girl. This is going to be fun. You're going to want to hang out for that. Any weed today, just so that way my brain would maybe work a little bit better and I just... Like I said, I get hung up on stuff and I'm tired of you suck. Why is this guy here? This guy sucks. I hate this guy. And then I'm doing that every day to come in to do this now, stuff. Like I said, I, I hate this guy. To tell you the truth, I fucking hate this whiner. He's not like this. That's dude. what he yeah. sounds like. It's not you know looking what? good. Part of me makes me wonder because he said he hasn't smoked weed today. So, like, could it be one of those guys that gets a little emotionally unbalanced when. Like when he's oh, fresh yeah. off so weed, absolutely. So he's an addict as well. Yeah, because you know, uh-huh. people Teal thinks he's impervious to the effects of weed, but just give it time. Give it time. Oh no! I, Do we know what? I type know the effects of weed, Kyle. I just don't care. <laughs> I, I understand how it doesn't make sense. <laughs> you can you can not care, but if it's I don't know, you're a baby. You're a baby weeder. You're a baby. Smaller. I've been smoking for like 15 years. Barely. Barely? I've been smoking since I was 18. I I'm 34. It. That's 16 years, actually. Oh, wow. I'm getting old. Mm-hmm. I did dabs. I, Dude, I, I did dabs like for like you're 37. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, did dabs for so seven old. or eight years straight, Kyle. Started smoking weed at 13. <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, sorry. I, I didn't have my first beer until I was 16 because I I'm a, a fucking square. Yeah, but nobody want to hear how <laughs> you don't see the effects and yada yada. No, I'm not saying there's not effects. It is a drug I see the effects. It, I just don't. I don't addictive. really care. I, I know don't how to mitigate them for myself. Addictive. Yeah, I'm not saying that at all. It's definitely. That's addictive. why this guy's crying. It's so feeling better this than guy bored is, is definitely. Addictive. Yeah, he shouldn't. Anyway. Yeah, but I also don't get like this when I doesn't justify exactly. Uh, I think I didn't sometimes know that I because... wonder. Sometimes I wonder if, like, the withdrawal from weed is partially, like, psychosomatic, I guess you could say. It is. 
but yeah. it doesn't doesn't mean it's not it's just habit it doesn't fuck you like up everything yeah. else like yeah. not only oh like, goddamn seen it all as old as shit in only the 66 no, I wanna, hey, young on, spry folk i want to see this guy cry why do we keep going off on tangents? he's already been crying I sleep i came in to do the show today and then just here's five bucks this guy sucks how much does the the gig pay nobody would do the gig for the amount of money i've been getting for the last few months Ooh, that that was a dig. Look, yeah, look at his eyes, <laughs> right looking at Aaron over there. Mm -hmm. Nobody would do this gig. Well, it's not really a gig. You're coming over to your friend's house to talk shit a little bit. Yeah. Hey, Till, how come you ain't been paying me for the last two years? <laughs> yeah, what talk the to the audience. What do you want me to do? <laughs> yeah. You get a second job? <laughs> Technically, a third, I guess you'd say. Cause I do treat this like a job. I fucking actually put hours of work in. Like, just last night, I spent five hours making a brand new fucking intro for burnt popcorn so Simper can stop fucking bitching and use original music. I had to learn how to play orchestral instruments, Kyle. I, I'm gonna brain fuck Why don't you right ask now. AI? You, you need to That's add. That's what I thought you would do. You could all do AI songs. <laughs> You need uh, to uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh shit, NBA. Sister Callie comes in for ten dollars and says, Colt dues. Well, thank you very much, Sister Aww. Callie. It's always yeah, good yeah. to see you out there. Thank Dude, you, you need to add in a clip of uh NBA twenty four K and oh, have Samper's face superimposed on it, dunking the ball. You want, I can show you the, the new bird yes. popcorn intro in a minute. I, I did this thing where like it put and no, sometimes to see this man fail and cry. <laughs> that put and sometimes Simper reloaded and then like he's like laughing and then I I superimposed the face melting from Mandy <laughs> so to, to insinuate that he is dying before us. <laughs> It was a very artistic intro. Nobody would. My son would. Well, yeah. He loves me. But he also thinks there's a coyote outside. Well, so. did sometimes. Well, you know, one day when there's a fucking coyote outside, you're all going to be happy that he warned you. Jon Snow said that the army of the dead was coming. Nobody believed him. I wish Jor I bet Jorah Mormont wishes he would have fucking taken that a little more seriously. Ar no, army of the dead was a different property uh john right, snow was game of thrones again? that was the white walker doesn't he have to leave again because he's crying yeah he gets up and leaves again but the the stream ends like an hour an hour and 50 seconds exactly i thought he ended it because of you know what occurred yeah turns out it's kind of funnier like it's the little cherry on the top of this this little story so Johnny gets upset. Well, we've seen him cry. We don't. We don't need to see more. Do we need to see more crying? A little bit. Just a little, a little more. bit. I'll skip ahead. Okay. Keto. But keto. I'll, I'll save it then for the end. I'll save for what happens. Like again. Then you come fucking do this show. I have. Do you know how much Reddit would explode <laughs> with hatred? And you guys are the fucking worst. And we want you all to die. If Mersh and I did a show together, but he wouldn't. Two of the most hated people. Night. Okay, he's smoking his weed, so he can yeah, go fuck now himself. He's well, he's chilling out. He's <laughs> calming down. Okay, smoking his weed, relaxing now. And then he cries again. Oh, I'm sorry for snapping on you about the weed too. <laughs> Just, <laughs> Kyle. it's because like, dude, what I always feared is what mm. I had to do, and I don't know when I do like a two month anniversary, I'm gonna. Share a bit with people like doing introductions. Oh, oh, that's that's hope outside the tunnel, or whatever. But what I always feared is like when you actually, when the worst shit hits, mm -hmm. it's when you're gonna have to deal with the annoyance of having to stop with it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And it it was well, what see, I had I, to do. I like at the same the time, I'm it? dealing with a bunch of shit and family and all that because I don't yeah. want to be lacking as a family member, as a son, and all that. Then I had to stop at the worst time possible, and it's what I always feared, and it fucking sucks. And yeah. I hope you don't don't have to go through that. You know what I'm saying? Well, here here's why I'm not so scared about it, Kyle. Um, you I don't know if you remember I went, I've been to jail for weed. When I was when I went to jail for weed, I was probably like six seven years in. Was smoking like a quarter of like like a quarter bag a day. Like that's two eighths, right? Smoking that a day. 
So I'll spend a lot of money on weed, fucking smoking a shit ton of weed. Yep, same. I had to go, I had to stop cold turkey and go through in a jail. year of probation. Not in jail. I was on probation for a year before they ever sent my ass to jail. Because I, when I started smoking weed, I was, I was at like 400 something pounds. And when I got caught, I was at like five, six, or not five, six, I'm sorry, 260. So like, I had lost a lot of weight, but all those years of smoking while fat. He still had a uh, marijuana a THC stick. THC is fat, fat soluble. Yeah. So I had it all stored in my fat cells. And so every time I'd go take a fucking urine test, I would piss through the goddamn roof. The first time I took a piss test, it was over 6,000 parts per unit. The guy looked at me and went, what the fuck? <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's a lot. <laughs> that, I mean, it sounds like a lot. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like quite a bit. What's this? What's the legal limit? He says, thirty-four. I went, oh, I'm way over the limit. <laughs> I'm like really far on the limit. At one point, that was this was during the time when I was doing like stand up on the side, just to you know for fun. And uh, I would talk to my probation officer about, it, and this was like the fourth or fifth time that I pee dirty, and like he's like standing there looking at the. Test. I'm just like motherfucker. I'm like I've been fucking like, you know, doing like flushes and shit, taking niacin, all that shit for like months, and it didn't didn't fix it. And uh, he's like, he looked at me, and goes, "Do you did you do this for your stand up?" I just went, "Who the fuck would do that? <laughs> Who would purposely put themselves into a legal hole for some fucking stand up?" Well, fuck I mean you. We know Johnny Cryfitz ain't doing stand up. He can barely stand. Now he can do some sit down. Hey, Big wave Boom. and steel toe team up. <laughs> it would be a chat full of people going, You want some coleslaw, you big titted fags? It's just my impression. But when of what I, when that I show stopped smoking for like. then, the reason why it was so bad is because I had the stress of all that probation shit. And so I was just fucking like panic and attack all the fucking time. And I. Your brain goes, oh, it's because you're not, you're not smoking weed. And it's like I've and, stopped. And I've quit. Why would you put when I, I, when know, I moved that's here? That's argue about well, this. But why would you well, put Kyle. yourself through that again? <laughs> no, but Kyle, here I'm, I'm gonna give you an example. When I moved here, when I moved when I moved from Colorado to here, I didn't smoke weed for like three months, and there was it wasn't a problem at all. Like I didn't go through any withdrawals or anything, and that was after eight years, eight straight years of doing dabs, like doing like smoking a gram of dab every fucking day. And I got here, I'm like, well, I don't have a weed connect, so I just, hey, come on, I'm like whatever. Trying to watch a guy cry, not yeah, talk about you. Sorry, I'm trying to tell stories we'll, we'll we'll talk about my life one day. that I've already heard multiple times. Oh, Eric, please. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut up, Tosi. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. You fucking Puerto Rican. You fucking Irish guy. Tweety75 says Johnny is on steroids pre uh, prednisone and it makes you uh, do and feel weird stuff. It's kind of like a, a roid rage. I can explain some of the... Yeah, that makes sense. He's got to take that shit for his MS. It makes you kind of all emotionally un... Maybe they're like fucking with his medication or something. I don't know what, why he's feeling this way, but definitely, definitely not doing something like that. I'm on it too. It's annoying. You're on st steroids? <laughs> no, for a zone. <laughs> well, oh. yeah. Oh. Sounds like a woman's disease. Come again? If I say the woman's disease. Shut up. Should we get to some of these? People are being very generous and very nice. Yeah, you should get to that. Two bucks from Raz of Chaz says, We have to know, has April been eating ham sandwiches? More of a turkey gal. Uh, bad luck, but you don't have to respond to these if you, you know, don't want to, to but you're more than welcome we to. to get uh, bad luck night. boy says, uh, oh, doing Challenge night. accepted. I never went crazy that often. I love then. cats. You You're get the angry, less bangable April. I thought April did a wonderful job. Well, I should think I'm less bangable. That I'm wasn't even that bad. Oh, go back. If someone it. says, yep, there he goes. We're that wasn't even that bad. Ambulance. We're going to have to call the way ambulance. Yeah, Trippie, we're, we're getting a hormone. Toned down. Right he could have been to for his fucking throat. 
And he's like, I like cats, and you're the less bangable April. That wasn't even that bad for Mersh. Am I wrong? Yeah. Am I tripping? Yeah, it's not really that no, bad. No, that I was think, the weirdest thing about it. it wasn't, whatever the cause really is, I think he came into the game today a little unsteady. Not to be yeah. mean or make puns at his expense, but I think he came in on a weak pair of legs today. Dude, Mersh came in and was like, E5, you hit my battleship. E4, you hit my battleship. Mm -hmm. E3, you hit my battleship. <laughs> that, that's what happened. Suck. And then someone says you don't suck. Everybody just takes everything Mersh says so fucking Do you let those so cancel out, or do you have like, comedian brain where you only see the bad one? No, I see them both. Okay. See, now that should cancel out. That's why when I do my show, I don't give a shit what people say, because I got plenty of people that are there to see my show. You Los Federales says, guys, let's here. get Johnny some money. That doesn't sound like the worst so idea in the world. Why cares? Uh, jo no. Clarissa anyway, let's go for another more sh less. Yeah, fire. so let's, let's get to the very end here. Yeah, because he does cry for like 10 minutes. This is going to be the place for these protesters. Do you, do you want to hang in there or do you want to take a few minutes? You want to go rest up? Yeah. Why don't you do that? Rest up. All right. Watch. I want you to force yourself to fight through something. Go. Eat. Listen for the crutches. Oh, no. No. So what happened there was Johnny tripped over the cable and unplugged the fucking internet. Oh. Oh, that's what. Okay. That's oh. what you're supposed to do. The rest of it's on Rumble because Rumble allows you to click mm -hmm. back in. But uh, YouTube, you got to make a whole new stream, which really fucking sucks. Mm hmm. I wish YouTube would let you click back in, like a you know he did that minutes. on purpose. Uh, <laughs> he just stripped, fucking grabs it with his foot. Fuck this show. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what he did. I uh, who knows, but yeah, definitely uh, don't do that on the internet, folks. Don't uh, don't bleed in the water. Sharks gonna get you. It's not good. Dude, you know what? You know what he? Because that's a morning show, right? You know what he had for lunch. A wham burger and some French fries. Did did you uh, play the part where he banned Marsh or? Oh uh, no, call we in? skipped past it. Uh, oh okay, okay. There was mods calling in to uh, yeah, ask if they could was... ban Marsh, being like, "You got to take his wrench so we can ban him." They end up banning Marsh out of the chat, and now Marsh is okay. fucking mad. I'm sure he's going to uh, rip Johnny apart on Nightwave later. Which I'm just like, dude, why? If he wakes why? up. Right? Did he even make it for ROTC? No, he was not on ROTC today. <laughs> At all? No. Wow. The whole show. Man, much be slacking. Wow. Hey, hope you enjoyed that clip or hated it. Either way, we're live Monday through Thursday, 8 p.m. Eastern, right here on YouTube or over on Rumble at rumble.com slash c slash ministry of dude. Links are in the description. But you know what? If you really love the show, you can go right on over to ministrydude.locals.com, sign up for the Hammer Club, just a mere $5 a month. Gets you access to all our bonus episodes where we really sink our teeth into the internet's most notorious, disgusting, and stupid characters. Come join us.